Hey everyone, happy Saturday. Um, I'm going to share these projects with you all so I can get them put away and off my desk and prepare for new stuff to make. So, and this is, I didn't make all this stuff today. I've just been collecting it over to the side, the stuff I've been making. So, I just thought I'd share. Um, I got this in the mail. I don't remember if it was yesterday or the day before, whatever day it was. I showed a haul video with it. So, um, I made this card today. Um, these flowers are from Michael's. These are from Michael's. And then I put Nouveau drops on it. So, pretty simple but cute. I did not make it a, yeah. I just thought it looked cute with purple. So, there's that card. I'm going to have to move it out of my way, though, because I'm going to smash it, and those Nuvo drops have not dried yet. So, forgive me as I walk away for a second. So, okay, so there's that. Um, I had gotten this set from Crafter's Companion a while back. Um, it had some other ones with it, but... Sunflower Festival. Sunflower. We find out May 1st if we're in. So, If not, it's still a cute card. And then I used this. So this is what I made. And I used these two Distress Oxides for the background. And I used these two Tri-Blends for the flower and then these two little pearls were just sitting here on my tripod stand and I was tired of seeing them sit there so that's why they're on there so there's that card cute so um then I had gotten this set from diamond press um I don't remember when it came out it was an auto ship I think from the first of the month is what it was um, I haven't bought a lot of their stuff for a while, but again, a sunflower. So I got it because of that. Um, I joined the auto ship on it. Um, we'll see if I, I keep it, but because I have a tendency to get tired of them and then I just stop them. So, but anyway, so I used the stencil in this to create this background and I used Nouveau embellishment mousse in uh, I gotta find the color I put this press and seal on it to keep it from drying up it's it was almost empty anyway because I used a lot of it um, I can't see the name on it right now so anyway, it doesn't matter. There's the color. It was one of the ones that came in the kits, a trial size. So um, as if there's not much left of it. And then I used these two inks for the background. And Anna Griffin gold and the embell or the sentiment. So I kind of like this embellishment mousse. It's smooth. So there's that card with that set. So, then I made two more bags with that die that I got from KS Craft. So, this was from, I don't know what crepe paper collection that was. I forget. It's crepe paper. I forget which one it was. It might have been mistletoe and mittens, maybe. I'm not sure, but it's crepe paper. And then... This is a Halloween one, and this is Crafter's Companion. It was a Halloween set um, from last year, so the paper and the Happy Halloween and the other stuff, it's all one kit, so. so I made two more of those. Don't get into Sunflower Festival. I'll have a lot of stuff to give the people in. And then last night... Um, Anna Griffin started a new thing, um, a mystery box auto ship type thing 
to monthly kit. And I'm not going to show what came in it because I don't know if everybody's gotten their box and I don't want to ruin the surprise. But I made some cards with some of the stuff that came in the kit was a, was a collection I already had. So I just, she, she put out an idea sheet with it. Um, so I followed the idea sheet just to make some quick cards with the stuff that I already had. I, I didn't even open the new collection. It was Annalise, so I did not open it. I just used what I had. So there's two cards. The dies did not come with it. Those were stuff that was in my stash. Luckily, I had um, what she was using. I forget what one of them was. I forget the name of it. Um, it was one that was in a birthday kit, and I think it was from Create 8, I think. Um, these two cards were made from this set, the 3D Victorian concentric dies. So, I used another new thing in my stash, so made those two. These are the ones from the birthday die set. Like I said, I think it was from Create 8. So, I made those. And they're not exactly the same, but the inspiration came from the sheets. Because some of the stuff, I didn't have some of the flowers and stuff in the kit that I had. And I wasn't going to bust into a new one just to make the cards. Since I had a lot already here. So, so those were ones I made yesterday. <clears throat> I actually had off yesterday for Good Friday. So, um, I think I told y'all that yesterday. I think I made a video yesterday. My days have run together. So then, I've been working on um, easel cards. This is the flower shop. Um, I'm, I can't show it to you standing up, obviously, because of the camera angle. But there you go. These are the new stickers that came out. I forget what they're called, but they're kitten stickers. Um, she had showed a, a card on her um, thing on HSN when she was introducing the product and so I, I borrowed <laughs> the kitten thing from that so I made those two I made a couple Christmas out of the flower shop I had the embellishments for the Christmas kit to make Christmas flower carts so I had those and then I had the Halloween stuff too so I made two Halloween Sorry for the glare. This is a bat or a bat, an owl that I cut from one of her dies or folders. I forget where it came from because I already had it cut. And then this bat and this owl and this butterfly. No, just these two. The butterfly was in with the Halloween flower cart kit. These two were from another collection and I put them on there. And then I made a Thanksgiving one. Um, these leaves were from my stash. I don't even know where I cut them from, to be honest. So, I think that is it. So, that's a quick share, and I can put this stuff away now, because it's kind of collecting over here, and it needs to go somewhere, because I'm running out of room on my new desk. So, I think that is it, and I hope y'all have a very happy Easter. Uh, remember why we have Easter, as we're running around with kids and Easter baskets and it's not all about that so um anyway I wish you well tomorrow happy Easter and I will catch y'all in the next video thanks for watching